everybody welcome back to another video on my channel I'm sorry that it's been a little while I'm struggling I'm not going to go into detail at all at this stage but I will say that postnatal depression is kicking my butt and yeah I'm just I've not been having a good start to the year. But anyway, I'm not going to bore you with that today. Today's video is a haul of our food pantry in Logan Reserve that I have just been to. I literally just drove past our house and um, clicked the remote for the garage so that Lee and Ashton can get in because we're basically home at the same time. Lee went to pick up Ashton. I put the babies in the car with a bottle and went to get this hamper because... We are not doing great financially this week. There's going to be a couple of things in this video that, uh, I mean, obviously I'm going to clarify, but you know, I've got people saying like, oh, you have a nice car, oh, you have this, oh, you're going to Taylor Swift, but then like you're relying on food hampers. If you want a more detailed version of anything or like you want to know a bit more information, make sure you head over to my Instagram at Boy Mum on a Budget because I usually like post kind of daily over there when I can, when I'm not feeling like crap. But also, uh, the thing that some people need to understand is that Taylor Swift, well, for starters, my cousin paid for everything up front for me. My ticket, my flights, my accommodation, everything. And I have paid her back most of it. And when we did it, like when we booked everything, it was literally June last year, guys, or like July or something. You know, that time of the year, it's tax time. And not only was it tax time and we got tax back, but I was also still on maternity pay. Uh, yeah, our, our car will actually be six years old this year. So it's not new, she's not new, okay? Sorry that we look after our car and it looks good. No, we're still like in debt with our cars and all of that sort of thing. And we struggle like a lot of other people, like the cost of living right now is absolute bullshit. Once again, we are delving back into the land of zip pay yeah anyway i just really wanted to like stop on the side of the road and do this intro because once i get in that house it is going to be chaotic so anyway i will see you guys inside the house for the haul okay here we are back in the land of chaos look it, it is really not a big haul which is fine yeah you've got an icy pole very good is it a baby bit a little baby icy pole oh show daddy Baby oh, icy no. pole. What do you got? Wow. All right, so like dying right now because over here, guys, are my shoes. My shoes for Taylor Swift. I got some kids. Anyway, I'll unbox them in a minute. But uh, yeah, just share it with Fletchy, darling. No worries. No worries. You have your first kid and you're like, you know what? They're not going to have any sugar. And then you have your second and third and you're like, go for your lives. Just go. Just go. And everyone is going and getting these hampers. And these poor guys, they just don't have the donations coming in as much as the food going out. So what are you doing? You're a ghost. Oh, creepy ghost. Oh, wow. He's a ghost. Right, so what have we got? We've just got like our pantry things and then we have some fresh uh, produce here. I got a passion fruit. Yes, darling, I know you're a ghost. I got a couple of onions. Oh, well, three onions. because That's what we're going to be running out of soon. I got a cucumber, a couple of tomatoes so that Lee can have tomato on toast for breakfast. There's a heap of beans here and the homegrown beans. Look how long they are, babe. They're like so big. Jesus. Yeah, so there's some short ones in there and then there's some homegrown long beans and which is good because I used a whole pack of beans in our casserole that I'm doing for dinner tonight, which I'll show you guys in a minute. I'm so proud of it. And then I got like about four potatoes. We've got so many potatoes. I don't know. I was just like talking to that lady and just mindlessly chucking potatoes in the bag. And then I got a couple of sweet potatoes as well. So, or maybe just one. Maybe I just got one sweet potato and one carrot. And then I got a loaf of bread. It's not best before until the 9th. Today is the 6th, so we'll definitely be able to use that. Then, uh, yeah, your pantry things, some muesli bars, which will be good for, well, possibly Ashton, but maybe just me because they're a bit hard for the kids to eat. Chocolate wafer biscuits, definitely snacks for the kids. Wheat bix, baked beans and spaghetti, which always come in handy. We're not huge on baked beans, but we definitely eat spaghetti. Like, I'll eat it on toast. Mum will eat it on toast. The kids will eat it on toast. So it, like, makes an easy lunch and that sort of thing. 
pasta sauce, a satay simmer sauce. Which sounds good. Yeah, fruit mix in juice. Yeah, so long life milk, beef noodles. I don't know. I donated the last lot of these that we got because we're just not really about these ones. We have the chicken ones. Penne definitely will be eaten. We're probably going to do another tuna mornay, tuna pasta bake this week because it's a cheap, easy meal that we have everything for. And we are very short with our pay this fortnight so that's why we're getting the food hamper look at you you walking come on good job this is really good this alfredo stuff because it's like makes a good side at the moment we have a kilo of beef mints in the freezer and half of that is going to be something and the other half is going to be rissoles and we're going to do rissoles and veg so i'll put that as the side so we got a whole thing like of honey like look at that that's great four bean mix little jelly crystals there that we can make some jelly with and <laughs> fletchy and brown rice so yeah that's basically what we got like i said not a huge haul but definitely like a few things in there that are really going to help us every little bit counts Yes, babe. That's my husband. He's so smart. Okay, so the moment that we've all been waiting for is... Uh... I'm also not just playing on my phone, by the way. I'm doing work. Yeah, he's doing inductions for his work. Anyway, now... <laughs> all I can say is I really hope... I hope that these fit me, okay? Because I was really unsure about what size to go with. Hey, gentle. This is what I don't, I cannot comprehend. It's the fact that it's all day from like 6 a.m. to 8 or 9. Like, where do they get it? The energy. Okay. All right. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, hang on. I don't even know how to do it. Just ignore, you know, all the noise as per usual. Oh, look at the nice paper that I'm ripping. Oh, they're so pretty. Oh, they're so pretty. Oh, look at them. Oh, can you see that sparkle? The laces are ribbons. It's so nice. Who knows? Maybe I'll just quickly get my whole outfit on at the end of the video and you guys can see what I'm wearing to Taylor Swift. So these are my kids that came today that I'm going to be wearing. So I'm going to have a look and just see whether they fit me. So this is my shoe fiend here, and he's just seen my sparkly shoes. But yeah, they totes fit, guys. Just uh, ignore the whole, you know, disgusting sock, because that's obviously not what I'm going to be wearing. Um, yeah, hopefully you can see that. They're nice and glittery, and I don't know, they kind of just make my feet look enormous. But yeah, they're going to look really nice when they're all laced up and stuff. But Ollie is going to be really sad that I'm not about to let him play with them right now because they're by brand new shoes okay so rice by the rice connoisseur but i did this earlier today i just like randomly decided um well you know these kids they don't nap at the same time so ollie had a nap fletchy didn't but it was like 1 30 ish two o'clock and i was like you know what i'm just gonna get the dinner ready so look at that i don't know whether you think that looks good like, I mean, it doesn't matter because it tastes amazing, but I reckon it looks good as well. And that is beef casserole. I will actually insert a picture into the video because I chucked out the little recipe base. But yeah, it's like a, the sort of recipe base that's like, I don't know, maybe a couple of dollars. But we actually got it from a hamper and you can literally just add a heap of stuff like whatever you want to it which is what i did and it just makes like this really delish hearty meal so that's what we're having tonight and just you know kind of just trying to like shop the pantry before we do any real shopping because we are so poor are you sorting them out for me baby thank you there's some big ones and some little ones isn't there oh yeah, mummy's just going to put the bread on the bench because we don't want that to get squished. Shit that I wouldn't even know. Thank oh, you, darling. I, oh, I do. That's beans, yeah. Hey. Thank you, darling. Falling. But Mommy, then I'm falling. It was falling. I'm falling. I'm falling. Thank you, baby. Come on. Ah. Oh, dear. <laughs> Probably need a tan. Okay, so amongst all the kids and like the shoe fiend, <coughs> so I've got my kids. They are beautiful and sparkly. Do they go with the dress? They look good. Yeah? So, yes, Ollie. So, yeah, this is my dress for anybody who 
pairs. It's kind of Speak Now, very Speak Now esque. No, I really like them. I really like them. And I, like I reckon them they'll be comfy. Like, I'll get some ballet socks so that, you know, I've got some socks under there. And, um, yeah, this oh, is my. Oh, Ollie, are they your favourite shoes? <laughs> Does that Hi, mama got them? Oh, you're a sweetie. Now, while the kids are distracted, quick, let's go into the other room. <laughs> Got my Tay Tay tattoo there. Yep. And, um, yeah, I'm basically set. And then where's my phone? I'm gonna, like, then you can stop recording. So. Sure. Oh, actually, yeah, I'll probably just outro the video now, I guess. Yeah. So, that's the video. You got a pantry haul, a food pantry haul, and you also got all of this, um, minus the truck. Uh, yeah, so this is my era's tour attire once again a lot of paypal paying for <laughs> and a lot of things were booked and paid for last year when we had a bit of money hope you enjoyed the video and i'll see you next time bye <laughs>